And the mission of the Children's Advocacy Alliance is to provide hope, healing, and a voice for justice for abused and neglected children in our community. I think most days what stands out is the commitment of our team to do the type of work that has to be done. We do have some of the best people um, associated with our organization. Um, they strive to be experts in their field. It's not glamorous at all. There are days that it's just completely heartbreaking, but we have a team, just a solid team of people who show up every day committed to making a difference in the lives of children. And I think that's one of my whys in this organization is that um, we have such dedicated people and community volunteers. We have um, just community leaders and donors that support this mission and, and I think that's what makes a difference. At Cross Creek, we've tried to create um, a warm and friendly environment where you can come in and have a fresh, delicious lunch. I just want them to be able to feel like they're either coming into their grandma's kitchen, um, making themselves at home when they come in and hear that screen door slam behind them. You know, to me, that's just memories. And whether you're um, dining with us or going shopping next door with Jennifer, you know, it's just the combination of the two that has always been my favorite thing. I have such a great team of people and they're the ones that really help us pull it all together. And I've always tried to um, listen to our customers too, because we started out teeny tiny in the back of Jennifer's. And I try to listen to them, see what they're wanting, see what they're asking me for. And then we try to create that and then grow from there. At the front door of every Sissy's Log Cabin is rule number one, which is the customer's always right. And beneath that is rule number two, which is see rule number one. As a manager, I'm instructed to treat every person that walks through the door as a member of family. And I only receive uh, two questions, either from Lamar McCubbin, our president, or Bill Jones, our owner. And those questions are always, number one, did we do the right thing? And number two, is the customer happy? A sign of a good jeweler is a jeweler that listens and wants to take care of your desires. Um, we're not here to push anything on you. We're here to celebrate the occasion the way that you want. And we are simply a source of guidance for you. As a manager of Sissy's Log Cabin, I'm most proud of our staff. Um, our sales manager, TJ, has went above and beyond uh, every time I've asked him for anything. He's indicative of our entire sales staff. They all go above to exceed our clients' expectations. They understand the importance of these occasions that we discuss. And the big challenge for us is to create such a luxury experience that our customers never consider going anywhere else. It's really kind of remarkable that the company has grown uh, to the point it is today. We have uh, offices in uh, seven states and 13 cities, and we're, growing. we're, we're recognized as a, as a strong regional contractor. We go back to the beginning. Uh, I don't think it was anybody's mind to think that far. What, where would you be 73 years down the road? Being able to provide uh, as many jobs as we had in, have in the community and seeing the people grow in our company, grow within the construction industry and become go from common labor to project superintendent and we have many third generation uh, people working for our company and, and it really gives me a thrill to see the uh, the number of families that are making a living working for Conway and I'm, I'm part of that part of that group and, and haven't had uh, looking back over I've been with the company 67 years in one way or another and I've seen all aspects of our company grow the good times and the bad times and it's a, it's a special thrill for me to know that, that uh, so many families have been connected with, with our company. And uh, so we're just real proud of the idea that we were able to grow our company and to be capable of handling just about anything in the state of Arkansas that, that can be built. And so I think that's a great story. At Century 21 Sandstone Real Estate Group, we're all about helping all people 
realize the uh, American dream. Uh, we're all about uh, promoting democracy and housing. Uh, we pride ourselves on being the smart choice for uh, real estate. We want to make sure that all of our clients are very well educated about the real estate process. We're all about, you know, building, building community. This community, you know, helps us support our families, and so we always want to be seen giving back to that community. I'm so thankful for my team. I'm thankful that they have allowed me to work for them to help us achieve our goals, you know, year over year and to uh, help us stand out.